for pleasantries. It's all right, go ahead. Neither have I come here to listen to your cheap lies. Listen, young man, watch your tongue, okay? And take it very easy. All is not lost. The princess is still there for you. Who are you trying to deceive? You or me? has been married to that doctor for some time now. No wonder you didn't make it an elaborate wedding. You never wanted me to know, right? You cheap dupe. Now listen, young man. I want you to realize that you're talking to the king. The king, my foot! Listen, old man. If not for my father, of seen to it that your end comes here and now. So, uh, you should be thanking your lucky stars. But, uh, trust me, uh, you'll be hearing from me soon. Yeah. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. 
Stop listening like a baby. The king is my toy. Huh? He's at my beck and call. Whatever I tell him, he can never say no. <laughs> now you are asking a childish question. Just look at what you are asking me to do. Do you know that lad is very big? More than six plots. You may even decide to sell part of it and use the money to develop the others. Huh? Nay, when a child fails in his duty to do the right thing, mm -hmm. his seniors will teach him whatever you want me to do. I marvel at your innocence. <laughs> One would think you are an old timer. <laughs> well, uh, you know. You have to play ball with me, huh? you know, sleep with me, <laughs> you know. <laughs> God. But, no, no, no buts, no buts. Just do it, and the land becomes yours. Judgment or no judgment. Hmm? And it can't, and it can't, it can't, it can't to go with it, baby. It can't. Oh, jeez. This calls for serious. So happy I'm coming. God had made a way where there seems to be no way. He works a way we cannot see. He will made a way. No, no, honey, wait for me. I'm not good at singing. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You're just gonna go now and get dressed, okay? I'm going to spoil you. Okay, just put it in. Okay, just, okay. <laughs> go, go, just go. Go, go, wait. God, I'm exploding. I'm going crazy.
increases. Darling, are you okay? You, you look moody. Are you alright? Martin? Yeah? Have I ever offended you? I don't understand. Why have you chosen to punish me this way? Princess, stop hurting me. Look, if there's anything, just go ahead and tell me. I mean, stop treating me like this. God, where, where is this emanating from? This is laughable. Are you trying to tell me you don't know anything about this? No. Honey, this... This is my face. Baby, I'm not used to dressing this way. Ah, this... This is it. This is one of it, honey. This is their game, their tit again. This is a setup. Can't you see? Just look where you will see this is a setup. Mm. Honey, this looks like a setup. You know I'll never do anything to hurt you. You all have guards. I'm willing to protect you with the last drop of my blood. Okay? I love you. Okay? Yeah, I'll always be supportive of you, okay? Discard that, okay? Are you okay now? Yeah, yeah. You mean princess? The daughter of the king of Agabi Kingdom? Of course. How can she be so cheap to people? Just by her father's words. You don't know, Gears. It is possible she's a for money. How will the governor's son be making love to her? In the car? <laughs> In the bush? I mean, everywhere. <laughs> you see, man, I pity her and I will marry her. I pity him. I hear she's already married. Married? <laughs> not married, yeah. If Jamie's husband cannot perform. <laughs> Okay, you school with her in London, right? Yeah. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. Okay, sit down, make yourself comfortable. Thank you. Um, well, I grab a glass cup for you, okay? Yeah. Um, yeah. I 
hadn't seen the patients for some years now, so just came into town and decided to check in on her. She said uh, she wants to see you, that you were her schoolmate in London. You guys were together and that her name is um, Vicky, Vicky Maria. And that's the next thing was what you saw. Vicky Maria? We were in the same school together, but she's not this girl. You mean she's not Vicky Maria? I think I know where this is going to be. Tell me, what, what, what is this all about? My father knows about this. Your dad? Yes. I see. You have exhausted all your creative ideas. On the contrary, Your Highness. As the river does not cease to flow, so my creative ingenuity does not cease to flow. All I require from you, Your Highness, is for you to be patient with me. I have done tougher jobs than this before with other kings. The immediate past king of Mapuzo, I was instrumental to the son ascending the throne. And so many other things that I've yeah, done. Lou, I am tired of listening to your sweet stories. All I wanted from you is results, not excuses. Your Highness, Your Highness, <laughs> just give me one more chance to prove myself. Just one more chance. This will be the last chance. Did you hear me? Your very last chance. Yes, Your Highness. As Your Highness pleases. Long live. Your Highness. Stupid woman, take what is it? I said take what, I'll kill you. I'll kill you, my venom. I'll kill you. Hey, young man, what is happening? Is it a doctor? No, no. Doctor, my wife underwent an abortion without my consent. I want to see that doctor, or heaven's must fall. Abortion? Yes. Take it easy, come over to my office. <laughs> So, young man, what were you talking about? Honestly, doctor, I want to see the very doctor that committed this act. Madam, can I see your card? He did not give me any card. He just said that hospitals here don't do such things. But that he can go out of his way to do it for me. On the condition that... What condition? He, he will make love to me and I'll pay him some money. Ah! He will make an attempt to make love to you. Calm down, young man. Calm down. Take it easy. Vera, you have finished me. So what is the name of the doctor you are talking about? They, they call him Dr. Martin. Dr. what? Martin. Martin? Yes. My goodness. How could he? Nurse! Please go and call me Dr. Martins. You see, Your Highness, my contact has just revealed to me that the hospital management board has sacked that boy two weeks ago. You don't mean it? Yes, Your Highness. You mean that fool has been sacked? <laughs> yes. Your Highness, yes. That is good news. Mm -hmm. See, a deaf grasshopper hears only in the belly of a bird. He has not seen anything yet. <laughs> yes. Now that he has been sacked, what is next? Your Highness, 
leave the thinking to me. Your Highness, uh, I've come to discuss with you something very important. It's all right. Whatever it is, you just name it. If it's within my power, consider it done. Well, thank you very much, Your Highness. In the first place, I've come to apologize for the way and manner I spoke to you the last time we met. See, I don't know what really came into me. I um, sincerely do apologize to you a thousand times, sir. Well, thank you very much, Your Highness. Um, then, um, secondly, I'd like to inform you that I've found someone else I'd like to marry. Young man, you didn't have to do that. I promise you that you will marry the princess and she's there for you. All you needed to do was exercise some patience for me and uh, she'll be yours. Come on, your highness, your highness. You don't need to bother yourself any longer. Now look at this caption, your highness. Sir. The governor's son gets married to a second-hand woman. <laughs> See, that's very impossible, Your Highness, so um, you can keep that on the sidelines. You see, the truth of the matter is that um, with me here is the IV. You see, um, the truth of the matter is that uh, the dowry of my sweetheart has been paid. See, uh, my father would have brought the IV himself, but um, he's kind of indisposed at the moment. So, uh, Your Highness, um, I have to hit the road now. See you at the wedding. to start it. But the simplest truth is this. We can't afford to help you. The daughter of the king of Agabi Kingdom. Just look at the hopeless. We can't afford to pay. Madam, what are you talking about? I need this job. Please help me. <laughs> Just treat me the way you treat other workers, but please help me. I know how you feel. Please don't create problems for me. Do you want me to be sad? We can't afford to pay you. 
I've told you. Okay, okay. All right, I understand. But I wouldn't mind if you cut my salary into two and you can have one, but please help me. Help me. We can't afford to pay you. Please look elsewhere, okay? What is happening? It appears that it is this my noble birth that is causing me all these problems. Has it now become a problem to be a member of the royal family? God, why? What is happening to me? What's all this? It's all right. Thank you. Bye bye. They didn't give me the job. Why? What happened? They gave me someone else. Oh, come on, is this a joke? I wish. Another person more qualified than yourself? Despite all the praises? All the promises? God, this is unbelievable. Honey, please. I have to see my parents, okay? I have to see my car. I have experienced it too. Some say they can't even afford to pay me, others will change their mind at the 11th hour. Please, I have to see my parents. No, I insist. Leave your parents Why? out of this. I'm a man. I should be able to handle my problems myself. I can't keep running back to your parents at every slightest given opportunity. I mean, have you ever thought where this whole problem could be stemming from? Have you imagined? Are you insinuating that my parents have a hand in what is happening to you? I haven't said so. Then let me see them. At least there is no way they will allow the baby and myself to die, please. Okay, okay, fine, fine. You want to see your parents? So be it. Just let me have this feeling. Baby, please. Everything's going to be all right, okay? Please. You don't have to worry yourself. Just calm down, okay? So, princess, it has come to that. You come to my house and you refuse to eat. <laughs> I'm your father. It's just that the whole thing is becoming too much. Even to feed has become a problem. Father, mother, please forgive us. Even if we have made mistakes in any way, we are your children and are bound to make mistakes. Please forgive us. To err is human, and to forgive is divine. Please forgive. When your children begin to put up certain behaviors, I want to laugh at you. You know? Mm -hmm. You and your husband have been going through all these kind of problems, and you couldn't come to me, your father, to tell me about it. Father. Uh, have I become so small in your eyes? Father, please don't misunderstand it. My husband and I do not want to overburden you with our problems. It's just that it's getting out of hand. That's why I decided to bring it to your notice. Your Highness, I, I think I understand what our daughter is trying to say. They know that the problems with leading our people are too much. So they don't want to overlabor you with their own domestic problems. I know you will always support her. You will always support her. My daughter, I have heard you. I've heard you. Mark! Yes. My card. Give it to your husband, okay? Wherever he goes to look for employment, let him present it and then mention my name. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Father. I'm most honored. Thank it's you. It's alright. Now listen to me, Princess. Will you eat some food now in your father's house? 
Yes, mm -hmm. Father. Thank you, Your Highness. So I came to seek employment in your department. I was actually sent here by His Royal Highness, King of Akabi Kingdom. I see. Are you here with a lot of application, your credentials, and the recommendation from the king? I said, um, this are my credentials. The king's card, sir. Come on. We've been expecting you since last week. The king spoke to us about you. Oh, sir, I just got the card yesterday. That's right. I'm sorry you are late. The old man you met on your way to this office, the person we gave that chance. We expected you since last week, you didn't show up. Hey, sir, but I just... My you... friend, you have to be up and doing. Good day. I want to see you later. Understand anymore. Disappointment upon disappointment. You can just imagine the last one that happened. The general manager said if I'd come five minutes earlier, I mean five minutes, the job would have been mine. Five minutes earlier. I mean, why, why must you always be five minutes late or five minutes, whatever, ten minutes? Honestly, no, this is getting out of time. What are we gonna do? You won't believe it. Elvis was sent out of school because of school fees. You know, I forgot to tell you. To feed now is even a problem in this house. It's okay, honey, okay? It's alright. This is for a purpose, I believe. It's happening for a reason. And you know, nothing lasts forever. Okay? I believe. Okay, no. Who is my house friend? Uh, I don't want to see anything. Listen, you've owed accumulated house rent for 300 pounds. Okay? And you're telling me, you see? What do I see? Please, sir. Please. I do not want to entertain your flimsy excuses any longer. If you do not know it, you better know it. I'm, I'm particularly not happy with you, okay? How can you claim you are the daughter of King of Agabi Kingdom and you are only me, my house friend? What does that mean? You think I run a charitable organization? Am I Father Christmas? Thank you very much for assisting us this far, okay? Just give me some little more time. I promise I'll pay you. I promise. Dr. Martin, please. I would want to tell you this. I am ready at any given time to forgo the three months areas of our strength, provided you vacate my apartment. Okay? And listen, if in the next two weeks you refuse to leave my house, the story is going to be different. Okay? this girl not to marry that poor medical doctor. She went ahead to marry the man against all her advice. And now she wants a favor from me. Huh? If you had married the governor's son, will you be going through all this nonsense? Will you? Listen, that is the price you have to pay for disobeying your father. Father, please be merciful. 
I have accepted my mistakes. Please don't leave me to die. Ellie, please don't leave me. Princess, you won't die. You still have a chance to be your old self. Why don't you kiss that medical doctor goodbye and come and take your rightful place? No, mother. I love mother with all my heart. Good. Please. Daddy, please forgive us. You see, you love Martin, which means you prefer poverty to affluence. So stay with Martin and stay with your problems. Your Highness, please. Please, you still have to help them. What? What? Your Highness, no matter what, our family seal is still on our head. What does she want me? I mean, what do you want me to do for you now? What? I should help you secure a job. It's okay. I will assist you. Get up. Get up. Your father has decided to come into this matter in principle. But is he going to put it into practice? That I don't know. Princess, I've lived with your father since I got married to him. I. I know when he makes a strong promise. What are you saying, Mother? Princess, what I'm saying in essence is that for your father to put this in practice, you have to leave that boy, um, Martin, and come and live with us here. Come on, daughter. You need to get married to Somebody from a royal family. Mother, I have accepted Martin, and there is nothing in this life that can make me leave him. Must everybody be rich? Even if it means eating sand with Martin, I am ready to do that. Mother, if loving Martin or living with Martin is a sin, then I'm sorry, I can never repent. is working according to plan. Now, the next step I want to apply is this. We have to put more pressure on the landlord so that he will eventually eject them. After ejecting them, what happens? It's very simple, Your Highness. Um, as soon as this is done, the princess will have no other option than to pack her things back to the palace. And that foolish doctor will pack his things back to his parents' house. What makes you so sure that the princess will not follow him to their house? Oh, my your highness, I have done all the statistics. There is no way the princess will prefer that place to the palace. And once she's here, the marriage will die a natural death. <laughs> <laughs> Genius! <laughs> oh, your highness, without you telling me, I know! <laughs> your highness, what I'm saying is that should anything happen to the princess, we will be involved. If she goes hawking, her name will be trapped in the mud. If she goes begging the same thing, your Highness, please, let us find a lasting solution to this problem. I then I just want you to admit one simple fact. What fact, Your Highness? And that is that you gave birth to a very stubborn girl. So, Your Highness, because she's stubborn, should we kill her? I'm not saying that we should kill her, but... Why can't she obey and respect me? Uh, the good book tells us that children should obey and respect their parents in everything they tell them. Why can't she obey me? Why should my own be different? Tell me. I mean, if she had married the governor's son, we wouldn't be having all these problems. No. She has to obey me. 
I'm a king. Look at the subjects, every one of them obey me to the letter. How much more my own child that I brought up from the cradle until she had become a woman will not obey me? No, she has to obey me. Mother, what is happening? What is wrong? Each time I go, Father will give me full assurance. But as soon as I leave, he will change his mind. Is my own face unpardonable? No, my daughter. Wipe your tears. Elvis was sent out from school the other day because of school fees. The day the landlord gave us his first approaching. Will I die because I married a man of my choice? No, my daughter, you will not die. <laughs> I don't know why your father all of a sudden, your father has become very hard-hearted. I've tried to make him see reason, but all to no avail. Good afternoon, Ma. Good afternoon, sir. Thank you. Princess? Yeah. Your Majesty, the governor's son is a better person to marry the daughter of the king of Agabi. Even when the governor's son does not have love and conscience? Princess. We must give this thing a trial first. Father, the eye is the easiest window to the heart. I have seen his heart through his eyes. He has no love, no conscience. Your Highness. Yes. Dr. Martin is here to see the princess. Oh, send him in, I'll see him right away. Send him in. Actually, Martin, I just want you to know that you have a place in my heart. Yeah. I mean, I treasure you so much. What are you doing here, Princess? Daddy, I'm yeah. with Martin. Ah, it seems you have refused to obey simple instructions. Right? Drag this fool into the boot. Don't touch this! Okay. Drag her into the car. Daddy, what are you Shut doing? up! Daddy! Oh. I don't want your father to know I gave you money. Don't tell him I gave you any money, okay? Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Pay Elvis' school fees. Then whatever is remaining, use it as part of your rent. Thank you. I'll pay Elvis' school fees. And I'll, I'll use the remaining money to join with the one my husband will make from the sale of his car. Is he planning to sell the car? Yes, Mother. This is so wrong. God, we have no option. God. It's okay. It's okay. Just keep managing. I'll keep talking to your father. Baby, it's okay. Whatever I have, I'll give you. Okay? Planning to sell his car to pay his house rentage. Zelu, I am beginning to feel for him, at least for my daughter. Your Highness, you don't have to. He has to pay for disobeying your instructions. Even if he likes, let him sell his only child. Zelu, that will be my grandchild, but next. Let him sell the car, then leave everything to me. Zelu? Yes. 
kindness. <laughs> Are you sure that is right? Your highness, have I failed you before? <laughs> Said 450, but me, I feel this car is worth much more than 450. Okay. But this is my cruising car, you know. I just, I don't have a choice. That's why I want to sell it. You see, there's a snag here, okay? The last time you came, I didn't take a look at the engine. As you can see, it's below grade. There is even a crack here. You see, I can't feel myself paying you up to 450,000. It's not good business. Rather, I'm going down to 250, and that is much more. You can smile home with that. You're <laughs> kidding me. You see, oh. I don't have time to feed you on that rain. Rain the bit here. Do you understand? So what I'm saying in effect is that you can go and meet other dealers and sell. But if you're ready, I'm giving you cash. 250,000. Can't you shake it? Cash! Okay. Rain the bit here. I'm going. The king's card, sir. Come on. We've been expecting you since last week. The king spoke to us about you. Oh, sir, I just got the card yesterday. That's right. I'm sorry you are late. The old man you met on your way to this office, the person we gave that chance. We expected you since last week. You didn't show up. Hey, sir, but I just. My you... friend, you have to pop and ring. Go there. Oh, can I have to see? Uh... I don't want to see anything. Listen, you've owed accumulated house rent for 300 pounds! Okay? And you're telling me, you see? What do I see? Um, please, sir. No, 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 please. I do not want to entertain your flimsy excuses any longer. I am ready at any given time to forgo the three months areas of our provided you vacate my apartment. Okay? And listen, if in the next two weeks you refuse to leave my house, the story is going to be unpleasant. Okay? Okay, okay. <laughs> you see, bros, I like you. <laughs> <laughs> What are we going to do now? 
It's a long story. Long story? Princess. Is it true that the princess has moved her things out of her wealthy father's house <laughs> to go and squat with that year doctor? Uh, <laughs> my dear, when I heard it initially, I thought it was a joke. Okay. Huh? Not until I went to Martin's house and saw things for myself. My sisters, it is unbelievable. Okay. Uh, how can she be staying with that so-called doctor who does nothing than to procure abortion? Uh, huh? Okay, that is what you were saying, eh? Just wait, let me tell you. What I think is that that princess must go and have her head examined. Yes! Who will see affluence and prefer poverty? Oh. <laughs> Why? That Sorry. question should be answered by her. I better hurry up to the youth fellowship meeting before it gets late. Eh? Okay. okay. We'll see then. Bye bye. Okay, bye bye. bye, -bye. I think that things are getting out of hand. I don't understand. What I'm saying is that you don't need to kill yourself because of love. Eh? Isn't it better you go back to your parents' house? When things get better, you will still come back. Ma'am, why are you talking like this? What I'm saying is that we are used to this kind of life. Hmm? I am feeling for you. Ma'am, I swore to be with Martin. And there is nothing, nothing will make me change my mind. Even if we're eating kennel, that's no problem. I just love him. When this Dr. Martin was here, we had a similar case. But the problem now is how to see him and how to get him. You know, he was sad. compiled my benefits in this hospital. If they've not, I'll be in deep shit. Oh God, hear my prayer. Dr. 
Martin says, yes, Doctor Who? Martin Doctor Martin? Yes, sir. Send him in immediately. Send him in. Yes, it's unbelievable. I am confused. I don't know what to do again. Mama! Mama! Oh. God Please has look. done it. God has done it. Maybe. Look, Maybe. I told you. Maybe. Look. Maybe what happened? I just went to the hospital to collect my entitlement. I told you. Okay. Before I knew it, there was already a case there waiting. The chairman asked me to assist him. In fact, I, I handled the operation. I was successful. Oh, my God, be praised. That's not the gist. I've been called back. What? I made the new medical director of the hospital. What? The former guy is demoted. Oh, wait, wait, that's, you've not gotten the real gist. Honey, you give me the scalp. No. <laughs> this is the scalp for me. Unbelievable. Oh, God, I'm sorry. <laughs> the Lord have answered our prayers at last. Hey. The Lord that answered by fire, oh. you, you will be oh, my God. The Lord that answered by fire, oh. you will be my God. Jahu Jaku Eria Jaho, Iga Buchi Bo, Jahu Waru Zoni Ba, oh. Iga Buchi Bo, Jahu Jaku Eria Jaho, Iga Buchi Bo, Jahu Mele Wobwe Iyabo, Iga Buchi Bo. Yeah. Thanks for being there, okay? okay. Thanks for being so supportive. Yeah, I love you, that's why. Hey! Anna, Anna, the car owner. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I have a feeling that we have lost out totally. I mean, this is like from zero to hero for that boy. A boy that was almost gone. A boy that was almost finished. Now look at it. Honestly, Your Highness, I've never handled a case like this. All my life, I've, I've never seen anything like this. So, what do you suggest we do? Are you suggesting that we surrender? No way, Your Highness. How can I surrender? I cannot surrender. No way, no way. Do, do you know that I single-handedly enthroned the King of Zaminka? Yes, I did. I did. So how can we now surrender? This is now a war of, of pride. The battle line has been drawn. Let me just go and get myself ready. I mean, dethroning the king or enthroning the king of Zabinka, what has it got to do with my getting my daughter back from Latus Lesbo? I have done this, I have done that. The more little thing you could Your 
Your Highness, where, where are you going? Zelu, I am going on this journey with you. I want to see things for myself. I don't want to hear stories. <laughs> but Your Highness, uh, are, you, are you beginning to doubt me? No. No. But I want to see things for myself. And you see, two good heads are better than one. Besides, my presence would add color. Uh, well, in that case, we are going with your car. No, 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 no. No. I'm going in this disguise. So we shall go with your car. Well, okay, Your Highness, please. <laughs> we don't have time to waste. Let us go. for our people. Imagine the bridge, for instance. Yes, Your Highness. Uh, if, if you know how many times I had to see the governor because of this bridge, you'd be Your surprised. Highness. This is the best thing that has happened in... to our people. Yes. yes. The fact is that uh, the bullet penetrated a very dangerous spot in the body and it will be very difficult to extract. So doctor, what do you suggest we do? Uh, I think we have to make arrangements and uh, fly him abroad. But come to think of that, flying him abroad could take a little longer and that means wasting more time. Doctor, what do we do now? I don't want to die. Doctor, please, I don't want anything to happen to him, please. Yes, there is one doctor in town whom I know can handle it very well. Dr. Martin Ogaku. Doctor what? Martin. He is the only soldier who can handle it. Yes. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Your Highness, no, 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 you won't die. Why is he saying that? Doctor, is a long story. Please, yeah. Your Highness, please. Yeah. Well, yeah. Your Highness, it's better to die gallantly than to go to that boy's hospital and... Uh, uh, Doctor! To worry at all. All you need to do is to play ball with me. That land, that land case between your people and the Congo. You see that land? Case or no case, the land is yours. But my there's, there's no but. You see, all you need to do is to play ball with me. Huh? So come. You know, um, the king 
is very sick. He was shot by armed robbers. And it is very likely that very soon he will join his ancestors. Uh, so, uh, if uh, you are interested in becoming the next king, then uh, it's better you start now to water the ground. So, so what do you want me to do? Uh, it's, it's not difficult. All you have to do is play ball with me. Yes, yes. You see, our people say that the basis of dog's play is the humility of one falling for the other. Exactly. You know I'm not from this place, so I cannot contest the kingship with the indigents. All I need is uh, <laughs> some cash. <laughs> Zello, <laughs> you are such a wonderful man to play with. I know, I know. Look, anything you say, I will do. Good. I will stop at nothing to capture that throne. Good. It is a promise. <laughs> yes, you understand. <laughs> All right. So I will see you. Huh? Okay. Good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Assassins to eliminate my son in law who has done nothing wrong to me. Dad! Yes. I wanted my daughter to marry somebody who has made it in the society. I wanted her to marry the son of the governor because I wanted to be made the chairman of the Council of Chiefs. I did not know that Almighty God did not approve of my actions. Eventually, my daughter got married to Martin. The governor's son got married to another woman. Yet I was persistent. I wanted to break them. I continued, I wanted to break them. Sometimes I sat down and asked myself, why was I doing this thing that I was doing? I realized that it was... It was my own greed. Selfishness. I was egocentric. Even when the governor's son he came here with his thugs and attacked me, he almost attacked me physically. The boy insulted me right on this seat here with his thugs surrounding me. I did not relent. I wanted to break my daughter's marriage to Martin. The Inspector General of Police, Mr. Tafa Balogun, received a presidential directive yesterday to personally take charge of the ongoing investigation into the Okija shrines, where the police last week recovered 20 human skulls and a fresh corpse. The IG is also to ensure that the brains behind the rituals, whatever their status, are brought to book. In other development, the police have arrested Mr. Anthony Jumo, the son of a governor, for allegedly killing his wife and the father Indo. Reports reaching us from our homicide deck says that at the time of the incident, the young man was under the influence of drug. 
When contacted on the issue, the governor said that if actually the boy committed a crime, he has to be punished in accordance with the law of the land. In Lagos mainland, one Mr. Fred. Oh God. is how I would have destroyed my daughter and my own very life too because I wanted class yes let me make it categorically clear this moment that the most important aspect of any relationship is love. Love. Every other thing is secondary. Yes. And that is why today I had to invite my son who lives abroad to come here and be a witness to this moment. I've never shed tear before my children before. He has to witness this moment to know that what the father did is wrong. My children. I'm very sorry for what I did to you. Honestly. It was due to ignorance. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Forgive me. I was greedy. I wanted a future that's a sure work for my daughter. And I also want to have connections. I didn't know that Almighty God has his own ways. Please forgive me. Father, no matter what, you are still our father. More than here, your son-in-law is also your son. We have forgiven you, Father. The pleading is too much. There is no way a good child will be at war with his father. Princess, you are very correct. Yeah, You're very correct. Your Highness, she's correct. She's right. Your Highness, what my wife, the princess, has said was what we both agreed. We are forgiving you, sir. And to add to that, um, let me bring this piece of information now to you, sir. That I will be sworn in as the new Minister of State for Health next week. And this was made possible by the advice of my boss, the Chairman, Board of Directors of the hospital I work at. <laughs> The boy is good. <laughs> Your Highness, the boy is good, yes. I saw it. He's a star, he's a star. I saw it. Your, Your Highness, he deserves a place in the palace. My the God. boy is good. <laughs> My God. Oh God. I was looking for connections. Outside. And because of that, I did so many terrible things my own blood, to my own daughter. Look at all the connections that I'm looking for. That line at my doorstep. Oh God, Lord, forgive me. What, what, what is this? Your Highness, what? What? What is this? Ah, these are all the things. Yes, Your Highness. Good. Zalinjo, I 
apart from these luggages, do you have any other thing within my palace? I, I don't understand. My people, I hired this man to advise me on how to run my kingdom. I did not know that he is the devil's advocate. He is the architect of every evil thing that has happened in this palace. What your highness? I... Every advice he has given me has gone wrong. Your highness, I... <laughs> Listen, Zelinger, after today's sunset, if you are seen within the vicinity of this town, I shall personally feed your body the vultures. But, but, but your highness, your highness, I, 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 I was only trying yeah, to do what you employed me for. I, I was trying to justify my pay, your highness, your highness, princess, princess, queen, queen, princess, 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 Oh